Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9 brought to you in association with ASB. This is your morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock, starting now with news from late on Friday night and early on Saturday morning where the Dow fell 2.5%. There are concerns about the US consumer who is not spending, trying to save and repay debt. We're also going to get news in the next day or so that CIT, the largest small business lender in the United States, has gone bankrupt. There were multiple bank failures, small ones to be fair, over the weekend in the United States. However, in New Zealand, there will be no spring surge in housing listings. That's according to realestate.co.nz, who's come out with numbers for October on listings. They're up 7%, but that's less than they were in the same time last year. And the inventory of the number of listings versus how many are selling, that's up as well. Bill English came out over the weekend and said he expected the jobless peak to be 7%, not the 8% previously forecast. He's working hard on the budget now to get bureaucrats to spend less money. He says the focus for 2010 will be spending on infrastructure, removing red tape and tax reform. I'm Bernard Hickey, that was 90 at 9, brought to you in association with ASB.